Hello guys, my name is Joel Makanya, I'm a CEO and founder at GT Tips. For today's video, we're going to cover how to modify an HTML element content via JavaScript. And Happy New Year to everyone. <laughs> okay. So the first thing we're going to do is to make use of the form. Specify a label. So it's a poor bit test. Uh, we need an ID. So say this would be name. This order. We will need a button. Set display. Yeah. We need an ID of uh, display. Okay, then that's it on HTML. Then let's go to our code.js. So in here, we're just going to specify, we need to create a variable called display, which is going to be linked to that button. We will say document dot get elements, get element by ID. Let's specify the ID, the ID is display. Okay, then that's it. So we need to add uh, uh, we say add events listed to this variable. That was a display dot add events listener. So the first argument we need to specify the action. In my case, it will be click. And then the second argument will be the function. I'm going to use a shortcut of a function, which is going to be a narrow function in JavaScript. In Python, we refer to it as Lambda. Then we say, we use this guy. We need to go and fetch the value from the user input, which is going to be name equals to document dot get elements by ID, then we say name dot values because we want to fetch the value. Uh, for the label, uh, which was going to be the output, then we say let dot output equals to document dot get element by ID. Uh, let me just double check if it's output. Yeah, it's output. Okay, that's it. Let me say fit. If that makes sense, display the content to the label. They will say output dot uh, in test equals to name. So this one, we're going to fetch the value from the user input and place it inside of this variable name. And then later on, since we link uh, this variable to the label element, then that's why we say output dot inner test. So the inner test is this area over here. So this will be the inner test. Okay, so let's find that. So let's have a look and see what 
is such we have yeah. Oh, one more thing, I forgot to specify the top on the button because if I don't do it, it will refresh the page. Uh, save button. Okay, so let me just open it to it. And here we go. Alright. Okay, that will be it for now. Okay, bye. Please subscribe, share, and like the video.